Raven Michael is doubt smurf. Nice. They are Byzantines and Malians. Two pretty good civs. Give me sheep, please. Ship. Why are you so far? Why can't the game just let everyone start with sheep under the town centers? I think that, like, I seriously think that should be a balance change made. Or the normal for Age of Empires. That sheep starts right next to your town center in vision. The first four sheep. It's kind of uh, silly that you would have a player potentially being miles behind because he didn't find his first four sheep. Completely due to luck. It's just kind of, oh god, we seem to have a very bad map here. Hopefully that's something map makers will consider in the future. And just change this cheap distance in RMS files if you want to do that. That's what I want. For every map, ever. I think pretty much every player agrees with this. Every high level player, even, I mean, everyone. Not only high level players, but it's so annoying when you can't find your sheep. And then suddenly you're far behind your opponent just because he had luck and had sheep right next to his town center. Well, your sheep spawned far away, far, far away in another dimension. Sometimes you even have sheep spawning in in the ponds where you like you rarely find them in time. Then Inca's free llama bonus sucks. I wouldn't say it sucks. They have good bonuses anyway, regardless of that. Still, one extra sheep is always nice. Their other bonuses are fine anyway. It's not that big of a deal. It makes Chinese OP as fuck. I don't agree with that either. They already have the bonus now of Teutons, where the town centers have bigger vision. So they pretty much find their sheep right away anyway. It wouldn't really be that big of a difference for Chinese at the moment. Solution, play Incas. <laughs> Good bonuses build farms faster. That's not the bonus I was thinking about. Wait, am I missing two sheep here? I feel like I am. Yes, I am. Why would it be a... It wouldn't be a big bone, like... It wouldn't make a difference in any way besides it make, making it fair. It wouldn't escalate for Britons because they're sheep owners. It wouldn't, like... Sometimes Britons find the sheep anyway right away. So what, what would be the difference? I'm not saying spawn the sheep under the town center. I'm saying spawn the sheep in vision of the town center so you can actually go and pick them up. I actually have super close deer. And I'm open scouts so again. I, again, I like the mobility and presence on the map. So you can, uh, yeah, you can like run around, engage here and there, get some good scouting information. Play Black Forest, just explore anyway. That's true. Charlie Chaplin is scouting us. Scary. Barracks going up from uh, Raven Michael here. Could be men at arms, could be Drush. People we'll go for that. Not liking our map here. It's gonna be tricky. Such so hilly and woodland very exposed. So I know that red is going 
barracks opening at least. That's some info. Now let's figure out what Blue is doing. I feel like Blue might go forward. There's Byzantines. Yeah, we're still Mind exposed to forwards. Uh, Reverend Lovestick, thanks so much for four months. Less than three, sir. I mean, we're... Scouts against the forward is a bit of a gamble. If I'm getting forward by blue, scouts are gonna be hard, especially against Byzantines. Where they get cheap spears, cheap skirms, all that good stuff. Well, the wolf is still there, in the case he's not going forward yet. Because it was a rush from red. What? Where are you going, man? Alright, he actually lives as well. Very nice. Okay, bring that those into the TC as well, okay. He's not Feudal Age. Well, he's Feudal Age. Take it back. Okay, both of them are... Well, one of them is a Drush. Okay, he's Feudal Age now, so they're both playing Feudal Age play. I don't see any buildings from Blue yet. Spearman coming forward. We have plus one on our spirits automatically. Barracks here. Oh, low HP will. That's a mistake by him. Ah, I didn't get it. And arms now. I need to bring this back. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. Not yet. Oh, no, no, not yet. Oh, no, no, not yet, I said. Oh, he is forwarding me. Guess I have to sack those scouts. For the greater good. Oh, multiple towers, let's counter tower that. Is he making a tower there as well? Okay, so tower rush from him. Okay, we should be able to get this tower up. Question is just what is the red's follow up? That's a good find. Yeah, still a little bit curious about Red's follow up to this. So far, so good though. Countering the forward. I need to scout red. Cannot leave him completely alone. Okay, archers from red. To commit to that tower, I'm really very surprised by that. Wow. It's got villagers coming from the race right through my base. He's really committed to that tower. Does he have fetching? Yes, he does. Oh, 
Yeah, we gotta deal with those those archers now from red. They're being a little bit annoying. Let's get these guys back to work. Yeah, he's kind of trapping, well, not trapping himself necessarily, but. Oh, that's good. Try and pick up the spear so our scouts can come in. That one hurts a little bit. Not gonna lie. Should have seen it coming. A lot more pressure being thrown our way this game. I think we've traded fine so far. I just really want to... Okay, there's stone there. Just surrender these stones and go all the way down here. Hopefully they won't see us taking that. Blue has not made any units so far, he's only making towers. Say that as I see a spear and a skirm. But I did start with units. Oh! Uh, my armor isn't ready either. I think we have to keep making skirms here. For a while. Uh, will this even be ever safe? The next question. We'll have to tower this forward uh, wood, I think. Make sure it's safe. I'll do a town watch as well. Yeah, well, I'll actually, let's, let's make a tower here. Don't want to give up this woodland just for free. Uh, some low HP levels here. Not the best situation. Skeddy might run into my stone, stone miners there. Probably gonna tower here, so I will lose all my farms there on that side. That's probably gonna hurt. We're gonna go cast Lage. Maybe make some battle elephants, actually. It would really help. Can't give up my farms just like that. Too much to my economy. Another range for him. Oh, res cast leech. Danger, danger. It does go three ranges though, no uh, stables. I'll fight while they still feel leech. Scary will drop a tower there. Don't think we can afford that. Yeah, it seems like he's going here with a tower because he's got a skirm, Keep, keeping a skirm there. Just gonna trade, yep, thought so. These skirms are just buying time for this. 
Oh, scouts. I want a castle, like, actually, where do I want a castle? Now that I think about it, where do I want a castle? Probably here, actually. I'll wait for heavy, not heavy, elite skirm. Just to clean up all those towers. See if he came back. He's making a forward monastery. Okay, no tower as far as I can tell. The bills. Yeah, I feel like we're in a good spot here. A little bit rough. Red still has a pretty high score. Forward pressure from him has done some damage. Let's see if we can do some counter rests at last and get some Arambai on the field. I'm just gonna trade. Buy a second castle. I feel like he's gonna try and push this area. If we can get a castle up there, that would be very nice. Spare the towers. He's doing a lead skirm himself. Would like to get some more thesis up. Our economy is not the best right now. That's for sure. We're gonna keep making some skirms. Oh, such a bad TC spot. Okay, so my first focus now is gonna be just hurt blue, get blue even further behind, first and foremost. Following that, we'll switch our focus completely on red. I do want to hurt blue first. <laughs> Wolves are doing a job. <laughs> nice. This blue seems to be in a weak position defensively, so I feel like we can really hurt his own, his base. This, this elephant doing some damage. Oh boy. Really coming in. I feel like I need ballistics here. Double monastery. The issue is we could see like a fast imp or something from. Uh, Ah. Red is doing a very good job of keeping us on our toes. Okay, 
Okay, so... Those are ballistics. Let's try and just get on top of these. See how it goes. Alright, well, so far that is clean, but the problem is he has probably a super nice boom going on behind this. Let's get the monks. Oh, we didn't get him. Oh wow, he has a really big army still. Definitely could have looked better. I need manganos for that. Ah! Probably tower that. To be fair. He is diving in very deep though. Could potentially backfire. Only I had that magma ready, or already. That's nice. Okay, very nice trade for us there. You overcommit a little bit there. We're gonna get a very efficient trade. Same time as we get a lot of kills there. With the uh, Arambe. Is he trying to convert my mango now? I think he is. Or was. I see red hitting. Okay, sorry, Cardo Riot. There you go. I see red hitting Imperial Age. So, oh, scheisse. I mean, this is why he shouldn't have sacrificed all his army. Now he doesn't have the army to push with that. Does not have the army now to push there. Yep, he's imp. units do we make here? Behind this blue has all the time in the world to reboom as well. A lot of potential problems here. Don't see a cast yet for red though. We did get some good rating on this economy. So now we just need to have units to take his uh, rams first and foremost. Then worry about the next after that. This castle might be a goner now. Focus on his arbalist. We're getting rid of most of his Arbalest though. It's a very positive. Very big positive, that is. Yeah, it's down to only a few skirms and some Arbalest. I'm gonna do some elephants in Castle Age. Send these units back. I need to be able to. I need to deal with this. I'm red. Nice shot. I 
gonna get a castle up there. If he allows us. Since I'm not going elephants in castle after all. They're gonna be in Imperial Age. At least that's the plan. Imperial Age. Oh, yes. If they only wanted to fight, the hell. Try to play like Arambai, Cavalier, Cavalry. I only got Light Cavalry. No, I got Hussar. Damn. That is interesting. Hopefully Red just chases me around here. The yep, blue will just go Mox. It only has plus one on his tower. He might be trying to go Cataprex. What's this upgrade again? Armor for elephants, yeah. Alright, where do we take this? I feel like we have to kill someone. <laughs> That's the tough part. Pikes, oh, oh, Cavalier. Okay. Oh, uh, uh. Get that monk. Wow, no accuracy at all. Okay, so how do we do this? How do we do this? Problem in my eyes remains the fact that neither of them are dead. I did the elephant armor for no reason. Okay, I'm probably gonna have to worry about the relics myself. Doesn't get bracer, that's one of the things that are is helpful for me. Yeah, we should probably try to get the elephants, but we can't afford it at the moment. I feel like we can only deal with one of them at a time for now. Really need a tower up here again. Oh no no! I mean a castle is what I want I wanted to say. Let's go and clean Red's army and get a castle up on that hill. I 
gonna do upgrades for four elephants now. But not sure if we'll get that castle up in time. Try and go for some raiding. What's this? 650 food. Come on. Okay, we're not gonna have bad elephants now. Once I have that upgrade in the castle, there we go. I'm gonna start just going for TCs. Oh god, <laughs> that goes down fast. Okay, that rating there is probably gonna be really good. I suppose will these elephants against Red's push. Oh, Blue is there as well. Them. I think we're getting enough eco damage on red. Oh boy, that's a bad fight. Bad trade, rather. Oh no, I'm getting raided. Those raids on my economy really hurt. Ah, he's raiding here as well. Those raids from blue there actually did really good for him. Okay, we need to stabilize. To reboom again. And take it from there. Starting to run low on gold. They haven't started trade at least. It's one positive. Again, the rating we got in on uh, red earlier might actually be a lifesaver here. Oops. Cast is being trapped down. Can we save it in time? Oh boy! I think we can. But that's a close one. You know, gold 
was there. Ah, oh, we lost that treb. Is that a castle? It is! It's a very risky castle. But we can't probably get away with it. This gold. I really want that gold. How likely it is that we will get it. It's not a story. That doesn't change the fact that I really want it. around by oh no all right that's unfortunate Rambo still die very fast he's looking starting to get very dicey Bar cannons, I, that's not something we like to see. Our gold is very low. It's gonna have to go for this. We lose that castle, I see that being pretty much GG. I mean, it's already looking like GG for me, in my opinion. It's looking very tough. I've lost all the elephants. Lost all the elephants, we're out of gold. Try and get that castle down. Probably make our own halberdier. Not that we ever have gold for that. Current, sta current status. Status. Have to switch into trash units. You can even do that. Okay, well, let's try a little bit more. It seems like it's over, but we'll try to make some trash units. And if that doesn't work, we can evaluate and see what we could have done differently. can stop this anymore yeah this is unstoppable for me especially without cold GG yes so let's evaluate a little bit here let's look at their economies well the problem was like whenever I try to deal with blue red always gets so much time to rebuild and vice versa of course naturally um, yeah, they have pretty, pretty good economies, both of them. Elephants were a waste. To a certain extent, yes. I would agree with that. I guess taking control here a little bit earlier, this front, and take this gold. That gold would have really helped. Um, of course, our map wasn't the greatest either. <laughs> you can always fall back to that excuse. We had really bad wood, bad golds, hills everywhere. We had a little bit more of an easy wall early age, maybe would have been uh, better off in early castle age. The tower rush was a good uh, decision by them though. Really, you can't like can't do too much against the tower rush. Just need more archers. I couldn't 
Well, actually, maybe Arambo wasn't the uh, the solution here. Arambo, they die. They have such low armor. They really die fast to pretty much any units they get hit by. Maybe I should have been more active raiding with my Arambo early on. How do I think Berbers would have played out? Probably better. Berbers have a, a better... I would say they have a better setup to fight against... Fight in early ages. That would have left me with a much better economy later on. Yeah, my, my opinion right now is... <laughs> Siege Tower was the solution. <laughs> my opinion is that, I mean, this map made it really hard for us. And also we went a little bit too heavy on the stone early on. Our economy really suffered. Our, this TC wasn't the best either. We should have. But then again, this, this TC is too far. Maybe we should have made our TCs this... Uh, even this way, there's not, not any good spots to place T town centers. Mm, it would have been really rough regardless, I think. But yeah, very nice play by them. The problem with skirms is that they I only get plus one armor as Burmese. So skirms would not have done a good job. They die really fast with that in mind. Yeah, they have good economies, both of them. I wasn't able to do enough economy damage to them. Yeah. GG. Yeah. <laughs>